Hey everyone, this is Dream from Where the Yokels Grow and in today's video we are going to be taking a break from berries and planting up beautiful spring flowers because I am loving this weather here in North Texas. If you all are new here, welcome. If you're returning, I'm so glad to see you again. Let's get growing y'all. I think I'm gonna plant them first and then we'll go over what I planted and I'm gonna give you a video right here so you can see what it looks like before I planted it I just put it in arrangement so I knew where I wanted things to go Isn't this beautiful y'all? We're out here in this beautiful sunshine in the evening planting up these flowers tonight. I absolutely love flowers. I love early spring flowers. Pansies and petunias and snapdragons are three of my favorite flowers for late fall and early spring. And I know some of you might think, oh, she's planting those way too early. Well, our last expected frost date is March 19th. And of the plants that are in here, three are cold hardy plants. Um, you can plant them in the late fall. They were over winter and I've got a video of some of my pansies here uh, overwintering. I also got some violas that overwintered and they honestly they weren't covered up and we just had all that freezing rain and temperatures for three days under the you know in the late I'm sorry in the low 20s and they're absolutely fine. Of these flowers that are in here I think the only ones that might be frost tender are the petunias um, but I also think they probably could handle just a tiny little frost. Now if it's going to be a hard freeze of course I'm going to come out here and cover them up. But in this beautiful pot we have purple pansies, we have purple and pink petunias, burgundy snapdragons, and this one is new and it's a pink and purple. Um, hopefully I am saying it right, um, Matabola. I don't know, I'll look it up and make sure I pronounce it correctly. <laughs> but it's a Matabola, and we have several more plants to plant throughout the throughout the property as this weekend goes on, and I will try to get small videos um, of each of those flowers that are gonna be planted. We're also planting up some yellow, um, oh my goodness, the name just left me. Easter lilies. <laughs> We're planting up Easter yellow Easter lilies out front too. So if y'all haven't seen the berry videos, I will link them at the end of this video. And we just took a small break from planting berries because the container that I thought I had to use for the blackberries has flowers growing in it and they're returning from last year so I'm not going to pull those out. 
but we'll get that back going and we'll finish off that series for you. Hey, thanks for hanging out with me and planting up these beautiful early spring flowers. I love flowers and I'm already seeing moths and butterflies and bees buzzing around, so I wanted to get some flowers in for them. I don't have a lot of dandelions out in the yard right now, so I wanted to get them some early food, so. You know because the garden when it's in full bloom we need them but if you all haven't seen my other two videos um, my planting of a golden raspberry and the blueberries you all should go check it out because it one of them is really funny it's me planting up a blueberry and my little one is constantly video bombing me through the whole thing and it's it's so hard not to laugh as I'm filming and I absolutely adore that little guy and I will never edit him out of any of my videos so if the him being in my videos bothers you just a heads up he's always going to be in them should he come and approach me if you all found value in this video today please give us a like with a thumbs up and if you're new here don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button because we post new videos often i could go on and on about gardening until i see you in the next video you all take care enjoy this beautiful sunshine north texas and keep growing Bye bye